Hey folks, welcome back. This video was brought to you by Mega and the Domain, and today lead designer Kevin and I are checking out the Halo Universe Series 3 blind bag. This is an incredible set with some iconic new molds, and without further ado, let's take a closer look. Hello again, YouTube, and welcome back to the Domain. <laughs> you gotta say that one more time, I was clapping. <laughs> Hello again, YouTube, and welcome back to the Domain. That's what it's all about, Kevin. All right. Thank you very much. For all these videos I've been filming the last couple of days, I've had to introduce the guests, but uh, you are very well known in the community at this point. I think a lot of people are surprised that it's not just you and Jan in an empty <laughs> office. <laughs> so, uh, Kevin, uh, happy to meet you. Happy um, to meet you too. Yeah, absolutely. We've been having a great few days, yep. and we've been talking about really what the fans would like to see from my time at Mega, right? Mm -hmm. And something that we just kept on coming back to was blind bags. On my channel, you guys will eat blind bags for every meal of the day. Like, you absolutely love them. It's dioramas and blind bags. First of all, though, we've got the previous blind bag series. And what's special about this is this is a prototype. Inside, we've got these really interesting sleeves. And I don't think the community has ever seen, like, these kind of prototypes, right? No, I don't think that's something that we've ever shown. These are packaging mock-ups that we do for internal on the inside just to see what the what the new envelope or what the new bag looks like so you see it the inside is it's it's empty. It's, they're really quite uh, really quite sturdy they're nothing like the actual blind bags but just for for graphic purposes this is what we work with yeah nice visualization i was certainly surprised when i saw these as well and you have quite similar ones for halo heroes i don't know who impacted this decision but I, like i'll just take some credit we're back up to eight figures guys we did it eight <laughs> figures in the blind bag series because like yeah th this is a great series um i really enjoyed this one and the introduction of all these uh, awesome spartans particularly ones that represent the series Silver team from the new TV show. That is amazing. Halo Infinite Series 5. I thought it was really surprising that there was a full Spartan series, but I, I appreciated it for what it was. The Pulse Carbine, the Scrap Cannon, all really great weapons to include. An AC Yoroi just really makes sense. And the AC for this series makes even more sense. Okay, so this is our Halo Infinite Series 5 blind bags. And now we have Halo Universe Series 5. Three. I think this is one of the best blind bag series we've ever got. Probably the best army builder set we've ever had. Like, yep, this yep. is amazing. So we're gonna run down them one by one, are we? To preamble this a little mm. bit, we know that fans uh, use the, the blind bags to army build. And so with this series, we're, we were really, really conscious that to be able to, to, to choose characters that fans want to be able to add to, to their armies and that will want to pick up multiple. Another thing that informed our, pick, our picks this mm -hmm. season was the fan survey. So a lot of you responded to the fan survey. You'll see some of your choices reflected in mm -hmm. here. We tried to keep the data always, always close when we were picking which characters we were putting in here. So this is uh, this is a fan uh, a fan series. <laughs> Call <laughs> this the the Halo Mega Fanvo 4.0, right. right? Or like right. 3.5 exactly. or something like that. Exactly. This is definitely like it's by the fans for the fans. Exactly. Pretty much. Yep. Um, so we're gonna pick out uh, my personal favorite. This is a figure that I've like been requesting Mega to do again. I thought it was like the logical choice that you would <laughs> do it again soon. It's the return, the glorious return of Chips Dubo. Can we call him Chips Dubo? Is that the canonical thing? It's not an official version of him, but uh, if you want to call him, go, go ahead. Okay. Um, I just ask that, and keep this in mind, if yeah. you ever do a proper Combat Evolved series, like a, a boxed set, mm -hmm. Oh yeah, it's Chips call, Dubo call it for Chips sure Dubo. Is, is on, on the list. Is this any different from the Clash on the Ring blind bag? No, actually, we heard the uh, we heard the feedback from fans saying that you know that that particular marine, the Halo C marine, was very difficult to find the first time around. Fans want to build armies of them, so we brought him back exactly as is before and give uh, fans another chance at it. I've like edited Chips Dubo narration over so many of my videos <laughs> before. Uh, it's an amazing thing to see. I'm really happy to see this guy again. It's time to do a marine pack, right? A Halo yeah. universe. It's like like a marine platoon pack, but it's one from each of them. Mm -hmm. You just you're missing reach, and then you can do a full marine yeah, pack. Yeah. Just keep it in mind. Just keep, right. it, keep it at the back of your head. No, no. I think you mentioned before the reason we could bring it back up to eight was because there were some repeat figures. That's exactly but... right. Uh, we we're, we're starting with six new figures, and we're bringing back two favorites. So the Halo CE Marine is the first one, and then the if second. You want to take a look at the second da, one. Da, da, da. The classic orange grunt, Halo Three version. But um, you know what the canonical name for this is, do you? No. Which one? It's Billy the Grunt. Oh, yes. Billy the Billy. Grunt. Billy I'm the sorry, Grunt. I knew about Victor. I... Yeah. <laughs> Victor the Grunt. <laughs> I knew about Victor. I didn't know about Billy. <laughs> the validation of hearing Kevin say Victor the go. Grunt is pretty cute. This is Billy the Grunt. He's like the official Grunt mascot of my channel. Billy has lived on throughout the years. To get Chips Dubo and Billy in one set is pretty cool to me. And we just... Just say it's canonically Billy. Okay, just, it's just, Billy. It's Billy and Chips. 
Guys, we got a canonical Billy. This is the That's official really cool. Billy the Grunt from here on out. It has been blessed by Kevin. Which one should I go for next? One of the Spartans. Yeah, I'm, I'm right. feeling this one. This is a, a, one of my favorite, I think one of the fans' favorite Halo yeah. 5 Spartans. Yeah, one of the top candidates that came out of the fan vote was you guys like the Helljumper armor. I voted for that. A lot of people apparently did. So um, we hadn't done the Helljumper armor in a long time. We're re-releasing it in green, which is something that's... We've actually never done. You've never yeah. done a metallic green hell jumper. I didn't know go. that, but there we are. <laughs> there, <laughs> there we are. Go. So first time in green. Halo 5 Guardians, did you do many metallic greens? I think that was the time where you were doing like more like olive greens and things. Yep, right? exactly. So uh, we met we transitioned to metallic green with Halo Wars 2. So that mm. would have been a year or two after mm. the Halo Five stuff. Oh, amazing! Yeah. yeah, that's a really dope figure, and obviously give it the, the Halo Five Hydra makes exactly. absolute sense. That is three out of eight. We still got a way to go. Next up, and we're building up to the really big ones. Um, well, let's actually, they're all really big ones. Exactly. Let's um, do a bad guy. Let's do a bad guy. Yeah. Okay, this one I think the fans uh, I can already hear like LS3D and G custom creations just punch in the air with this yeah, one. Yeah. This is a Halo Two Anniversary Elite. Oh man. Yeah, so that one we also heard the fans when they were saying that, that this is a mold that they've wanted for a while. We flirted with the idea a little bit with uh, by doing retests, uh, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. in, the, in the 20th anniversary pack, except, you know, that one didn't have the, the full helmet, obviously, for, for mm -hmm. obvious reasons. This one is the honest to goodness uh, Halo 2 anniversary Elite Miner with the proper helmet, proper chest, proper And what's everything. it holding in its hand, Kevin? Well, uh, something that we that we, we mentioned uh, a little while back uh, on social media was uh, was a, a redone, a redesigned plasma rifle. And that was very well received. Yeah. <laughs> I, like, I haven't really thought about it up until yeah. that point, but yeah. it was quite a goofy size. You've been rocking that plasma rifle literally since probably 2010 or 11. Yeah, something like yeah. that. Yeah. yeah. So to see this in yeah. little baby size. This one is like nice and wide. Gosh, I actually, I really like this. I hadn't looked at it properly until, yeah. until we this video. I try and have like a natural reaction to these things. How many new pieces here? Well, there's the helmet and the, the plasma rifle. That Everything else, helmet. surprisingly, we had. Yeah. Wow. That is an exceptional helmet. Amazing. These three figures are great, for sure, but this thing. And this is a common figure, everybody. Yes. It's a common figure. Oh. This elite is gorgeous. So how many new pieces here? Well, there's the helmet and the, the plasma rifle. A Halo 2 anniversary elite, ladies and go. gentlemen. Amazing. Now we're moving on to one of the most requested Spartans <laughs> ever. Like, uh, I, I, I cannot say how many uh, requests I've seen of this. And truly, when you're going through this, this is pretty much all what the fan vote asked for, right? Like, yeah. already these three were in the fan vote. Was the Grunt in the fan vote? I don't uh, know these three were. No, exactly. The, this the certainly Marine, was. The Elite, the, the Spartan Helljumper for sure. Mm -hmm. And then this Spartan coming up actually topped the list on uh, new Spartan armors that you would like to see. And it's a Halo 3 armor. It's the long-awaited CQB. Yes, <laughs> look at that. And it has a painted weapon, it which does. is not usual for blind bags. No, exactly. Uh, painted laser, Spartan laser. Am I dreaming? That's amazing. Yep, so new head, new chest, new shoulder pads, and like you mentioned, the uh, the painted weapon. It's fairly surreal, honestly. A new articulation CQB in all its glory. So now there's not very many Halo 3 Spartans missing from new articulation. That slightly grey undersuit with just the black armor. And is this final production? It is. Yeah. yeah. They look amazing. Tickle me impressed. <laughs> Absolutely. Next up, we've got... I know, You know which one I'm saving till last. Next one, yeah. we've got... A Halo 2 anniversary? A Halo, this one is meant to be Halo Wars. Brute. Halo Wars? Halo Wars Brute. Yes. Yeah, Brute Mario. Yes, he's fighting his way out these blind bags to go find Thrall Slayer. <laughs> <laughs> just, Kevin even walked up to me in, this morning in the office and he was like, just this for Thrall Slayer. Yeah. I was like, yes, <laughs> absolutely. This guy is built out of uh, mostly the Halo 2 anniversary uh, Brute Miner that we did. Universe Series 1, I think. Mm. But it's recolored and a little bit of a nod to our very first Brute that we released in 2010. I guess it is. Except that it's, yeah, except that it's all modern parts. I guess it is. Hundreds of those have passed through my <laughs> hands in the years. That's amazing, look at that. Spectacular, with a silver brood shot and a green base plate. Now, no blind bike series is complete without an AC, ladies and gentlemen. And when I saw this, I was like, yeah, that is the obvious next like, AC. It right, makes exactly. absolute sense. Yep. You have the mold, but you've only released it once. Yep. It's AC. Jager Adomni. Time to bring Jager back. He's still available in Phantom. When he's introduced in the game, the first time you meet him, he's active camo. Absolutely. Right? So this is, I guess, first appearance Jager. 
Yeah, it, it is. It is. And I want to see as many pop and swaps as possible. I love like half transition in pop yeah. and swaps. My all-time favorite Halo hero by far is Jordan Dharma. Jordan Dharma. By yeah. far. Yeah. By far. It's just exceptional. So this is amazing. It's cool that you brought back the old energy sword because I thought that was mm -hmm. toast once mm -hmm. you did the uh, the new sort of sleeker design. Yeah. But then it made the return, I believe, in the builder's box. Yeah. And then from that point onwards, yeah. it was uh, it was back in the canon. It's and, a little uh, bit closer to the infinite version. Right, what it looks like in the game. That is fair. Whereas the more angular one is definitely more Halo 5, so we like that uh, distinction. That balance, yeah. So we've got uh, one more blind bag today. Let me just uh, get ready for this one. <laughs> this is, um, yeah. Again, another obvious next step. Yes. The evolution of the Flood. Yes. And we've had the Flood Marine mm -hmm. in Halo Hero Series 18, and the Flood Elite mm -hmm. in Traxxas Factory Flood, now Floodgate Firefight. And of course, the next one had to be. The Flood Brute. Yep. So making its debut. As yeah. a common figure. As a common figure. As a common figure. After 15 years of, yes. of Halo Mega, we've never released this character before officially. Basically just a new torso and everything else works with the Flood system that you already know. Mm -hmm. So the arm, the claws, it's all back. Brand new sculpted torso to do the Brute. Yeah, I see the big difference here. The Brute head is integrated in. If I may say, like, I really liked the human. That head just perfectly, and the facial expression's amazing. <laughs> this seems to be, like, uh, pretty much the same level of detail. Like, this is excellent figure. Silver Brute Spiker. When's the last time you had a Spiker? Oh my gosh, that was a while. Blood Brute. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Just amazing. <laughs> Just amazing. I mean, what a blind bag series. We packed it with as many army builders as we could, you know, and including a couple of Spartans as well and, uh, and a named character. I mean, you can but, literally uh, army build a Halo 2 Anniversary Elite. Halo 3 CQB. Halo 3 Blood Brute. <laughs> yeah, Halo Wars. Uh, Brute as well. Amazing. Yeah, Kevin, this is amazing. Halo Universe Series 3 in all its divine glory and so much to collect here. The sort of the bold, really sleek new packaging design really lends itself to just having the figures pop straight out of the bag. This is a blind bag series by the fans for the fans and that is not focusing on the blind bag at all. Where's the focus? By the fans for the fans. <laughs> <laughs> and Kevin, thanks so much for joining me, man. You're certainly welcome. Oh, absolutely Thank spectacular. You. Big thanks to Mega for sponsoring this video and stick it with the domain for more behind the scenes content.